Well, many animals were also displaced from Hurricane Dorian in Grand Bahama and Abaco. And our intern, Paisala Forbes, tells us tonight about the Bahamas Humane Society's plans to transport them to a better place. It's heartbreaking. I mean, there's no other way to say it. Um, unfortunately, a lot of people have lost their lives and a lot of animals have lost their lives. It's unlike any tragedy we've ever seen here. The Bahamas Humane Society is working diligently to help the animals who experienced Hurricane Dorian. Board member Dr. Amanda Pinder told our news team that animals currently housed in the shelter will be transported to a shelter in Florida in order for Humane Society officials to monitor animals that have arrived from Abaco and Grand Bahama. But one of the main projects that we're working on is 50 dogs are going to be leaving this evening on a yacht that the owner has generously donated to us. And so we're going to be basically moving animals out of the shelter here to make room for families um, that have been evacuated from Abaco and Grand Bahama so that they need a place to house their animals temporarily. We would be able to provide that for them. Dr. Pinder says when the animals from Abaco and Grand Bahama are sent to Nassau, their goal is to give them medical treatment and most importantly, love. A lot of diseases that could be waterborne um, from all of the flooding. So when they come in, they're going to get booster vaccinations for some of those concerns and obviously antibiotics and different things um, to try and help prevent those issues. Adoption coordinator Fiona Moody pointed out that Humane Society officials are extremely grateful for the public's help during this time of peril. I'd like to thank the public. The public have been so generous um, internationally. We've had people on vacation come and give us money, gone to the store, brought dog food, cat food. Of course, I for coming from the States to, to help. The people have donated boats and planes. I mean, the outpouring's been great. Uh, so it, we've all been busy and it's tiring, but it's, but it's, it's very uplifting. I'm Paisala Forbes, Saturnas Network News.